Breaking news, AKT decide. As we speak, this is the update on what is going on now in Ekiti State where we have Fayemi rounding up his tenure as the governor for a second term. Um, it's about time. He has nowhere to go with regards to being a governor. And if you know very well, he picked up the presidential form but later stepped down. Fashiwa Jamed Bola Tinubu saying he's a young man and um, he's stepping down for his elder brother. Yes, to the race is on to get the next person to lead Ekiti State in the couple of years to come. Frontliners uh, in this very election are the SDB, SDP, APC and PDP candidates. Today we brought you up to speed that one of the APC candidates who brought in the money to share to, to voters was picked up by you know efcc again another person has been picked up breaking news akt decides sdp candidate shegun oni allegedly vote buying by other political parties also picked up well this is what is going on now on disclosed the shortly after casting his vote at the polling unit at 006 ward 4 11 Edo Ose, local government area of the state. Mr. Shegun Oni, the candidate of the Social Democratic Party, SDP, in the ongoing governorship election in Ekiti State, says residents had been indoctrinated into voting for one particular person. Oni disclosed this shortly after casting his vote at the polling unit of 006 Ward 4. If for King, in a do is a local government area of the state it says political parties are given money to candidates to vote for them the former governor who was accompanied by his wife and son voted at about 10 22 a.m when asked about the the situation report he had been going he has been getting from his agent across the state. He said some of our agents are worried for the fact that they alleged that there is vote buying in Ado Ekiti Oye and other local government area across the state. Although we have captured these areas, we are awaiting what the result from these areas will be. The APC candidates are on to vote buying seriously and we are watching to see what INEC would do in this regard. We know that they are buying votes and they are giving money to candidates. One thing that is against one thing that is against INEC jurisdiction with regards to voting. Candidates, voters are being given money to go on and to vote in Ado Ekiti and some of the um, local government areas. Money is being shared to people to get them to vote for them. We will wait patiently and see how INEC will attend to this. Leave us a comment. Remember that the elections are right on going now as we speak and Nigerians we have to be on point to ensure that we do not allow this persons or people to take over our mandate. It is important, it is expedient as a matter of urgency that we pay attention and ensure we expose every wrongdoing and those manipulating the whole election process in order to favor them in a particular capacity or manner. The level at which corruption has eaten deep into our democracy is unreal. And even when you know you expect that people should be well informed at a, as at this point in time and should vote informally and vote correctly, however, you'll be shocked that you know some of those people, you know, their mandates can be taken from them and nobody particularly is paying attention to say this is the reason why you should not sell your vote. This is the reason why you should not give that this man that woman your mandate because they've got nothing to offer your roads will be you know will be a dead trap the hospitals nothing 
to particularly help people and sort out issues on what is going on. If we want our place to be better, if we want to do something worthwhile for our people, we cannot resort to vote buying and we cannot allow these people who manipulate the system to continue in this same way. We have to rise up to the occasion and we need to present and let it be known crystal clear that such and such and such is not acceptable in any way, form or kind because, um, you know, currently what's going on is that with the new electoral act all those uh, ballot snatching box snatching and the rest may be reduced they may not have the opportunity to to snatch ballot buses and go on and say oh this vote is for me and just switch the papers it may be difficult because uh, we're going to the electronic process where you'll be accredited and it will be it will be assured that you are the one who voted that clarity will surely be there you know and so since this is how it is many people are resulting to you know going the other way okay if if patrick will not go if uh, musa will not go to the mountain perhaps the mountain can come to musa you see, so that's where it is now. If Mountain will not go to Musa, will, will go to if Musa, will, then Mountain, you know. So this is what is happening and why every one of us have got that duty now to rise up to the occasion and refuse our fathers and mothers to be tricked. Many people who have served this nation in one capacity or the other have not been paid their gratuities. They've not been paid, not because... Not because they did not work for 36 years, 30 years, they have worked, you know, worked themselves to the bone. And when it is time for them to, you know, to, 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 to be served, when it's time for them to get what they've been contributing to the government and those who are in authority or in power, take advantage of what belongs to the people and they begin to manipulate it and we not want to do right by the people. So these are some of the things that, you know, we cannot, um, you know, we cannot, uh, pay, we cannot turn a blind eyes to. No, we just can't. We can't do that. So that's why we cannot, we cannot afford to allow them, okay, take that which belongs to us. Okay, we cannot allow them take that which belongs to us. So Nigerians, it is high time we rise up, okay, and pick the right candidates. And pick the right candidates so that uh, every one of us, okay, every one of us can be happy. Every one of us can be happy. So it is, it is what it is. It is what it is. Okay. So we ha all have, we all, we all have to give our quarter meaningfully, contribute it well in order for things to go well in this nation. Okay. In order for things to go well in this nation. So it, it is that time again. Leave us a comment. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. Bye for now.